You know, I think this project means that for us as people with disabilities that we can join in, that we also have likes, dislikes, we have styles, uh, we have personalities, and we're able to show those off. This project means a lot, and it means the inclusion of everybody, and that's what I'm all about. Everybody should be included because of who they are and the life that they bring to the world. To, to me, it's just another way to show people that people with disabilities are just the same as everybody else. This project started as an attempt for me to prove that the idea of inclusion and body positivity had a place in, in Nashville and that it was the right time. All the designers that have stepped up have just really proven to me that this is not only a possibility, it's happening. And we have the opportunity to show the country and the world that we can be the city that starts this inclusive movement. I want to be a model, but I've never done anything like it, like this before. You know, so I like uh, the message that it brings to people. You know, like I said, I, I love fashion because it is truly democratic, but I think there are some portions of the population that are left out sometimes. And, um, you know, when it comes to disabilities, just with the new news that my family has and the new issues that we're facing, it's, it's just something, it's just something that can't be ignored. It's kind of, you know, it's emotional. It's, it's because it's just not fair. <laughs> and, you know, anytime I feel like someone's left out or it's just, it's just not a good feeling. Um, so it's, it, it feels really, um, feels really emotional and like tender to me to be a part of this. When I was really little I started struggling with my sense of self-worth and my sense of self-image and I really want to be able to be um, a representation of an honest way of self-expression for it doesn't matter who you are, it doesn't matter how old you are or what size you are, you are beautiful and there's something really valuable and unique about you and I want to share that with other people. I was so honored to be asked. I remember when Alicia came up to me and said, hey, um, I have a project I'm working on. And I just immediately said yes, because I knew it was going to be incredible. And as we got into more saying that fashion is for everybody, I think the name just says it all, that fashion is for everybody. And I'm very proud to be a part of it. For me, this project is a celebration of um, different people from all kinds of backgrounds and body types. Um, I know that I've, you know, in the last few years recently started being proud of who I am and for my body, and um, I'm really excited to be a part of that celebration. Well, I think it's fun to be involved in um, the first time of, of anything, um, so it's exciting, and hopefully it will be a huge success. Why can't we be included in everything? It's not very hard to do, it's just letting someone in regardless of their abilities or disabilities. We are all uh, in this beautiful world together. It doesn't matter our age, it doesn't matter our size, it doesn't matter our abilities or disabilities. Um, it just matters that we are in it together. Well, first, I love you guys. So that was an easy yes to the project. And as it unfolded, the depth of what you guys were going for, um, it fit right along the lines with like how most things that I do mean what most things that I do mean to me and that's helping other people helping to bring either awareness or appreciation or love or consideration to groups of people for me first of all I think it's gonna be fun yes. and uh, you know most most important like Jason was saying just uh, the ability to help others and uh, like one of the one of uh, my daily internal monologues is is um, how can I take what has been given to me and you know give back in some way and help out. Or... I think it's really cool and I feel honored to be a part of it and I like that it's being done the way it is. That it's not just a very special fashion show or something. It's just this is legitimate and it's a thing and it's a production. It's being taken seriously and it's an event. I'm really excited to be a part of it. People often ask me why I'm interested in fashion or they assume that it's something superficial. And fashion for me has always come from a very 
deep place of being able to express yourself and say something about yourself um, in a way that other mediums can't. And I think that people with disabilities also need that opportunity to express themselves, maybe more so than someone that doesn't have a disability. And so to be able to use that fashion and say that is so therapeutic, and that's why we need to pay attention to it. It's awesome. Um, it shows, can anyone can do this? This project is showing people that, yeah, you can come. You can be a part. You just have to have, make that first step. You can be who you are and not have a problem with being who you are and still dress in whatever fashion it is that you would like to be dressed in. I, I'm excited to be a part of something so grand and I feel like I mean, the fact that we're already here in such a short amount of time, you know, I think is great. Where, you know, other people have been doing fashion weeks for years and years and years and no one's ever still done something like that. So I, you know, I'm excited to see the next one after this and like where it grows and, you know, maybe it goes to other cities, like possibilities are endless. With my fashion, I like to break any type of boxes and I think that fashion is for everybody is a really great symbolism of that. Trying to just bring in everybody into fashion, exactly what it says, instead of just having the skinny models or even just the plus size models. I think it, it should be for everybody. I know there are some shorter models out there, um, but there's not a lot. So I'm hoping it definitely, you know, kind of breaks the ice, it can open some doors, and it can give me a chance to do something I really love. This is actually a hard one to answer because it can't really be said in just a couple sentences. Um, and I don't want to get emotional about it. Um, it's, it's something that I think started with uh, Alicia and I meeting at Pura Vida Vintage a couple years ago. And, um, you know, we weren't even thinking that far ahead at that point. But attending Fashion Week with her a couple times um, and just really, you know, making a decision that this was something that would not only be fun to do um, and be, would be worthwhile, but is important to do. And um, yeah, I think it's going to be one of many to come. Gosh dang it. Why you got to ask me those hard questions? The Behind the door.